Eight days of over 220 films representing over 40 countries, there's sure to be something for you. Join me as we take a look at the 2010 Nashville Film Festival on this week's Arts Break. This is the 41st annual film festival celebrating um, independent and student films and we're very excited about the lineup that we are starting to put together. It's going to be a really, really exciting year. It just seems to be getting better each time around. It's a great event for the town and it's a great event for the filmmakers. This year we've added some uh, new categories. Uh, we divided the competitions down so there's not quite as many in each category and added a new director's competition. That's for first time feature filmmakers. What you'll see in that one is sort of return to the independent roots. These are the ones that were made you know, by maxing out credit cards and gathering the troops. We have a great film called Dear Lemon Lima. It's a really light, fun comedy. There's a lot of laughs to be held and it's also got a lot of heart. I kind of call it uh, Juno for the tweener set. It's blonde. Blonde is yellow. Your hair is white. Yeah, well, it's blonde. In addition, uh, because that stars a great character actress, Beth Grant. A lot of people may know her from the movie Sorted Lives. She played Sissy. She stars as a supporting character in Dear Lemon Lima. She also is the executive producer and co-star of another film in the program called Herpes Boy, which is not actually about herpes. It's about a, the nickname that the main character gets from having a birthmark uh, right around his lip. Again, it's got a real uh, genuine heart, but with some of that uh, young irony that's going on in film today. I'm an actress slash model slash dancer. Christy, please, this is not supposed to Should I hold up my headshot? No. Applause. Thank you. I'm We've also that. added a new category that we call World Cinema Today. And that's a bit of a hodgepodge, a bit of a collection of really what's happening all around the world. And you're going to see some big names in some of those films. Tilda Swinton uh, is in a film called I Am Love, which is just magnificent. And it actually uh, comes to us from Italy. I believe by the time it's all said and done, she's speaking four languages fluently throughout the film. The hardest part for most people is to sort of navigate. How do I know what to see? There's so many different films. And so we're finding ways of being able to break that down by having a world cinema, by having some categories. Because for us, all these films are first time. And so people don't know anything about it other than the synopsis. And I don't want people to be intimidated by the fact that there's more than 200 movies out there. Your festival experience can be as simple as, that one sounds interesting, I'm going to try it. So that's what I think a festival is really all about. It's you know, taking that chance to try something that you wouldn't normally go see in the multiplex because that's what we really represent. The 2010 Nashville Film Festival runs April 15th through the 22nd at the Regal Green Hill Stadium. For more information, visit us online at wnpt.net slash arts. This NPT Arts Break is made possible by the generous support of the Ingram Charitable Fund.